you are already using in built scalar functions in your series development. For example, get numeric value or maybe concat with space and so on. But you know that you can also create your custom scalar function which can always return a single value based on different inputs. To create a scalar function, right click on the code data service, click on new. You will find two options, scalar function definition and scalar function implementation reference. Created the scalar definition, which is nothing but the function interface with the name Z get discount, having one input parameters as total amount and returning a single value of type decimal float. Next step would be to create the implementation for this scalar definition. In this pop-up, you need to mention the scalar function definition name, the description and the implementation name. Depending on the engine, you need to add either underscore ana for analytical or underscore sql for sql implementation and the third stage we have to link up the mdp class and method implementation under mdp reference field so i have created one mdp class having a static method called calculate discount with the add-on for scalar function and mentioned the scalar function definition name it's an implementation section i have added if else block as a custom logic which will return the result after calculation finally in our series view let's use this reusable scalar series function as we get discount we are passing that input parameter as total amount with a value with travel data total price to calculate the discounted amount. Here you go, the discount amount is calculated perfectly applied on the total amount as you can see over here. Hope this is helpful. Thanks for watching and subscribe for more.